Let's go straight to Nairobi. There has been a result in the Kenyan elections. Let's join our Africa correspondent, Yusra El Bagir, who is there uh, and can talk to us. Uh, Yusra, we're just looking at scenes now. Tell us what's happened. William Bruto, the current deputy president, has just been declared winner of Kenya's presidential race. Now, this announcement comes after an arduous six days long day wait of verification of votes, and his opponent and former prime minister Raila Odinga's party have contested the election. And moments before William Bruto arrived to the National Tallying Center, chairs were thrown, tables were flipped. There was a lot of issues happening and they're now announcing his win. So we'll see how things go. Also, the election, the Electoral Commission chair, four out of seven of the Electoral Commission commissioners have denounced the results of this election, while their chairperson has just currently declared a winner. So in the next few hours and days, we will see the true reaction of people in the country, especially as the results are contested at such a violent and explosive level. Israel, we saw the scuffles break out at uh, the centre a little earlier on here on Sky News. Um, you know, people of Kenya have been waiting nearly a week for the results. The Deputy President, William Ruto, winning by 50.49%. What happens now? Because you do get a feeling that this could be contested. I mean, before the results were even announced, Chair, you know, uh, Raila Odinga's agents stood outside of the National Tallying Centre and contested the results. So what we're likely to see over the next few hours is, is a contested outcome, especially since, as I said, commissioners from this very, ele very same electoral commission have come out and denounced the results of the election and have doubted the transparency of the tallying. Let's see if we can listen to, to some of what's being said now by William Ruto. Members of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission, led by Chairman Wafula Chebukati, uh, fellow countrymen and women, good evening. It is a wonderful evening and I want to thank God that we are here this evening to witness this momentous occasion as the people of Kenya restate what is in Article 1 of the Constitution of Kenya that all sovereign power belongs to the people of Kenya. I want to thank God for getting us to this point. I want to thank God that today we have concluded this election. I know that there were predictions that I won't get to the ballot. There were predictions that we won't get here. But because there is a God in heaven, we are here. And I want to, in a very special way, say and confess that without God, we wouldn't have been here. Uh, so that My is the former Deputy President of Kenya, Kenya, William Ruto, uh, now uh, formally uh, accepting the, the results of the Kenyan election, making him one. President, uh, winning with 50.49% of the national vote.